Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Outtoos. In this video, I'll be showing you how to disable laptop keyboard for Windows 10 or 11. But before we start, hurry up and check out our latest software just under this video. So let's get started. So in this case, how do we actually disable our laptop keyboard? Well, disabling it is actually pretty easy, but you need to follow the following steps and check a few things for some alternatives. So first things first is sometimes laptops have the functionality to actually disable the keyboard themselves. So in this case, some manufacturers has this as the plus on your keyboard and put the shift key or the right shift key on your keyboard. So in this case, once you actually hold those keys together for 8 seconds, sometimes they would actually disable your keyboard and you won't be able to start using it again. Now, in this case, some uh, laptops like H, uh, in, in my case, I think HP is uh, the laptop that has this one. In this case, they have a dedicated button for it, so someone else has that, so you have the option to disable it yourself. But in this case, sometimes if you don't have that, how do you disable your laptop keyboard? Well, it's actually pretty easy via Windows. So first things first is you need to go to the bottom left here, which is the search here. Just type in the following, which is going to be device manager. Go ahead and open it up. And from here, what we need to do is we need to search for the following, which is going to be the keyboard. So let's go ahead and open, up, open this up, right click on it. And if you have the option to disable this keyboard here, choose that. So if you don't have the disable option, I would recommend you to just click on uninstall device. But in this case, first, I would recommend you to start using a mouse first because your trackpad would actually be affected with the uninstallation or uh, the removal of this uh, device here. Now, once you click on uninstall device, just follow the steps for you to uninstall it. And once you've done that, there are a few things that you need to do next for you to actually retain this specific feature or this specific uh, setting that we did. Now, in this case, uh, when you actually restart your laptop, sometimes it would actually automatically update its drivers. Now, meaning you will be able to start using your keyboard again once you restart your laptop. Now, to prevent that, we need to actually to access a specific setting or to turn it off. So at the bottom left, go to your search again. Just type in device installation settings. And from here, uh, what we need to do is uh, we need to actually access the change device installation settings. So let's go ahead and click on it. Now, from here, instead of yes, go ahead and click answer no here. Click on save changes. And once you've done that, once you actually restart your uh, laptop, it will no longer update your uh, keyboard automatically. But I do have to warn you, this will also affect or your other um, uh, devices that you have. So you need to manually update some devices or some applications that you have right now. But in this case, uh, that's about it. So uh, hopefully this video was able to help you. And if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.